Hello everyone, Kirith here, and today I'm going to give you my honest opinion about the most controversial topic in Gran Turismo 7 at the moment. It's this, the really controversial curb glitch in Daily Ray C. You hook your curbs on the wheel, you get a massive speed boost around the corner. Now people have really different approaches to this, really different points of view, and I put a YouTube poll up, I ask people what they think. I'm so grateful for the incredible responses we got on that poll. Amazing to read just the differences of opinion there. Um, absolutely fascinating and every opinion you have is 100% valid. Now in that poll I noted that there are two YouTubers at the moment who are taking a different approach to this curb glitch. Roy Alexander saying it's cheating, he's not going to do it. And then you had Key25 who was doing it, he wanted to get the fastest possible time. Now, and by the way, I didn't say Key25 was endorsing it or anything. I think he tweeted at me saying I was saying that, but if you read the poll, I didn't say that. So sorry, Key, if you, if you thought that, but it's not what I said. So there's two different approaches. Is it the fastest thing to do or is it cheating? And my opinion is basically going to offend half of the people watching this video. So it's a stupid video for me to make, so I'm going to offend half of you. What do I think? Well, my background, as you may know, is in real world motorsport and karting in the same karting championship that Super GT did for many years, Jimmy Warbrent started out in. And in that karting championship, let me tell you, you do absolutely everything you can within the rules to get around that racetrack the fastest. Absolutely everything. You'll go to track walks, you'll look at where the curbs, you can go over them, you'll look at where the white lines are wide enough for you to get a little bit more on the grass. You'll pay for track guys and the track guides will tell you, look, here's a little, here's a little trick of where you can really minimize the way around the corner you can really cut this corner and ultimately the way that's assessed is in that karting championship on every corner in the races they have a marshal and if you exceed the track limits according to that marshal you'll get a penalty and you'll lose positions in the race now for me the equivalent in Gran Turismo 7 is the way that they code the track limit penalties and this has been a little bit arbitrary over the years so in Gran Turismo Sport it was often the edge of the curb on the inside, not the white line that was the track limit. So if there was a curb on the inside, you could go well over the white line and not get a track limit penalty. In other places, the white line didn't mean anything at all. Think about the home straight at Monza, where I had some very controversial moments with people defending off the white line. And again, it wasn't coded into the track limit. So in my view, that's fine. So my view with the curb glitches, if the game's not giving you a track limit, then it's fair game. And I'm not going to blame anyone that's doing this. It's a very tricky skill to pull off anyway, so it's not like anyone can do it. You have to be quite skilled to get on that curb and ride it. And I also don't have any issue with people saying that this is cheating and they're not going to do it. Because ultimately, I appreciate there's a grey area here. It's a physics bending thing to do in the game. Most other things we do respect physics. And going around the curb in this way Although I fully recognise that curb riding is a thing in most sport. And I remember reading a review of, I think it was Colin McRae Rally 4, an official Xbox magazine. This must have been way back in like 2005 or something. And I remember the reviewer saying, this game is so realistic, you can even get your inside wheels um, into a divot on the inside and you can carry more speed around the corner. I remember thinking, wow, that's very cool. That's very realistic. So I completely get that you can do this in real life. I do think that the speeds you get in GT7 are a little bit unrealistic. So, my honest opinion is that if you want to do this, go for it. I'm not going to blame you. I'm not going to say that you're cheating. I think it's part of the game and the game isn't penalising you with a track limit. I'm also going to say that I think Polyphony should really try and patch this out. It seems a bit of a randomised or... <laughs> an inconsistent way of getting that speed it's not easy to do the curb can spit you out and it seems to offer a kind of randomized element of when you're going to get a really good sector or not and i don't really think that's what gran turismo 7 is about so i would encourage polyphony to patch this maybe put some bollards on the inside maybe flatten off the curb so you can't get on it like a rail and then the adjudicators the assessors of the race have essentially said right we consider this to be exceeding track limits but until that moment, the whole top 10 is doing this. I don't blame them. I don't think it's a hack or an exploit or a cheat. I don't even really think it's unethical, by the way, because we're here to race as fast as possible. We can't become, in my opinion, we can't become kind of judge and jury on what's ethical or not. 
we're just racing drivers and we're there to race as fast as possible because if we try and make us judge and jury we're each going to have a different opinion on what's acceptable what's not when you enter these gray areas so a very controversial opinion i've offended half of you so I'm, I'm apologies to the half of you that i've offended um although your opinion is completely valid and mine may be wrong so <laughs> and to the people that agree with me on this i may disagree with you on the next one so <laughs> it's a bit of a weird video to make let me know in the comments what you think about this do you has this changed your mind has this given you a different point of view has it consolidated your point of view um do you think this should be patched out are you aware of any other glitches like this or exploits things that could be cool glitches and exploits in the game that we should be aware of let us know do feel free to drop us a like and a subscribe if you want to see more investigations this sort of stuff because we've done a lot of it on the channel when it comes to credit glitches and other bits and tracks and stuff like that but yeah it's a very controversial one i wanted to give you my honest opinion viewers i feel like it's very 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 important and that's it so that's my honest opinion i don't think it's cheating or hacking I think it's part of the game until they patch it out, but I would encourage them to patch it out. So there we go. Those are my thoughts. See you all next time.